an American Christian missionary accused of sexually abusing girls at an orphanage he founded in Baumate County has been arrested in Lancaster, Philadelphia. U.S. federal prosecutors have said Gregory Dow 60-year-old will be charged with sexually molesting four teenage girls. Gregory is accused of four counts of violating U.S. law against sexual contact with minors in foreign countries, U.S. Attorney William McSwain said. It is one of the most heinous crimes, actually going out and sexually abusing young children, said Joe Bushner, assistant special agent in charge at the FBI's Philadelphia office. Dow is accused of abuse from 2013 until 2017, when prosecutors say he fled back to the United States to avoid prosecution in Kenya. Gregory and his wife Mary Rose had in 2008 settled on a 1.2-acre land in Boido, Baumet County, where they started the Dow family children's home. The children's home is described as refuge for orphaned and abandoned children on their website and fundraising promotional materials. By 2015, more than 80 children found a home at the children's home but in 2017, Mr. Dow fled Kenya never to come back after an arrest warrant was issued against him over claims he was sexually assaulting children under his care. Before his travel to Kenya, Mr. Dow had been convicted for sex-related crimes in the U.S. and had actually served time. After Mr. Dow left Kenya, his wife tried to flee in September 2017 but was arrested by the police. She was charged with cruelty to children by, among other things, having girls implanted with birth control devices. According to police records, she was released on bond on September 16, 2017. She later fled the country leaving the orphanage behind. Dow purported to be a Christian missionary who would care for these orphans. They called him Dad. But instead of being a father figure for them, he preyed on their youth and vulnerability, prosecutors said in the court filing. A federal judge in Philadelphia on Friday ordered Gregory Down to remain jailed until a detention hearing next week.